Uh, I think, why don't we play some Grand Pool World, guys? Why don't we play this? Old school. Time for some old school shit. Hang on. Grand Pool World by Make it so. uh, me. I made this a long time ago. And let's play some Grand Pool World. Uh, what do you do at the start? Oh. <laughs> it's so simple. Has like 3,000 votes. Unlike candles, needs more Make votes. So. so simple. Huh? Uh, elsewhere, thank you for the 21 months acted. Thank you for the resub. Thank you very much. Somebody post this drop again. It's also on Discord. I'll post it one more time. If you need it again beyond this point, it's there. How do I play my hack? Well, you got to remember, uh, I made this hack a very long time ago. A very, very long time ago. So. Hack is dated my good friend, Grand Pooh Bear. Good luck. Have fun. Very, very long time ago, dude. Fantasy NFT football team. All right. Grand World 1. Let's do it. Shit. <laughs> Shit. Does anybody know the release date of Grand Pooh World 1? Does anybody know? I don't actually know. 2017? There's actually a block there if you go backwards from the bonsai. <laughs> it's a pretty good block. Uh, is it Spooktober soon? It is. Uh, it is October pretty soon. Hey. Jesus fucking Christ! I'm gonna get hit by every goddamn fish in this. <laughs> Still laughing at my own trolls. Make it so. Damn. Uh, Bumpy Numption, thank you for the 10 months. So uh, a big part of me making Grand Pearl 1 was that I was very inspired after Dram 2. Like when I finished Dram 2, I was like, all right, I want to make a hack now. Like that's kind of what pushed me towards doing it. And I remember there were things about Dram 2 that I hated. Like I hate, one of the things I hate in Dram 2 is the first level. So with Grand Pool World, I was like, all right, I got to make a first level. I wanted the first level to be like fast, go, like no back and forward, like run, 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 run. Like I, that that was like, so like in a lot of ways, I kind of feel like Grand Pool World was like a response to Dram 2 because there were, there were so many things that really pissed me off in Dram 2. <laughs> Hey, 20. Do I hate this game now? It was my first. I, th I feel like I should be like a little lenient on myself to say that this was my very first ROM hack. So. Like this is my first Mario World ROM hack I ever made. It was the very first one. Uh, I think it's pretty well put together. Uh, it works really well. It's got some cool ideas. It's also got some stuff about it that sucks. And I like, my God, like it's like embarrassing now. But I think it's overall pretty well, you know? It overall has aged okay, and it's still playable and fun, you know? Hey. Ah, I got spin. What are the bad things? Uh, the fact that there's no fast retry. Uh, it should have had fast retry for sure. Um... I think probably one of the worst things that didn't turn out well at all, like probably didn't turn out great at all would be Bowser. Uh, the boss fights are pretty not great.
I think uh, some of the color palettes are questionable. Even more, even more so than say like uh, like Grand Pearl Two color palettes are much better than Grand Pearl One co uh, color palettes for sure. The bosses are outrageously awesome in Grand Portal 2. Oh my god. Uh, that is not what you do there, actually. <laughs> you know what? I'm actually not sure what you do there. Okay. I still don't remember. How hard is it to implement quick retry? Uh, it's not too hard nowadays to implement it. Uh, if you tried to put it on the Grand Portal 1, though, it would break some of the levels and setups. Um, so. <sighs> I definitely remember that it was during the, the making of the second level that I was like, okay, I guess I'm going to name this Grand Pool World. Like, it was, it was during the making of this level that I was like, alright, I decided. This is when Pooh was like, oh man, if only, if only Bar would make Grand Pool World. He won't though. He's not going to do it. He'll never do it. There's never going to be a ROM hack named after me. <laughs> All right. Uh, blue, blue beach. Oops. Should have been on the pole. I'm not, dude. I'm, I don't want to touch Grand Pool. I don't want to touch Grand Pool 2, let alone Grand Pool 1. I would rather make something new. Then, uh, then revisit old stuff. Literally does not bother me one bit. Ah. Iron Man 1 is a fucking banger movie. That movie's a fucking banger, dude. I think the last half is maybe slightly more dull than the first, like, half of it. But, bro, I fucking love that movie. It's so good. What a movie. One thing, whenever I go back and rewatch Iron Man 1, one thing that does kind of bug me about it is that I feel like the entire movie, Robert Downey Jr. is mumbling. <laughs> oh, that was, that was shitty. Make it so. You know, I, this level kind of, it doesn't, this level doesn't look bad. I don't think it necessarily looks good either. But you know what I love about this level? I feel like the music, the music is an utterly perfect choice. I think that's something I'm pretty good at. Something I'm pretty good at is choosing music that is exactly right. I think I'm pretty good about that when it comes to level stuff. Occasionally I might pick a, a music that's not as good, but uh, very, very good at picking music that fits the level. <laughs> I actually was picking music for Grand Pool 3. Like I picked a bunch of music and then I, like, I forgot it all. So I have to like do it all again. <laughs> I forgot it all. I had music, but I foregore. It was kind of funny because, like, after this level, actually, to get the uh, to get the mist in this level, I had to. Like, nowadays, it's easy. I can do that in, in any level I want. But uh, getting the mist in this level, I actually uh, Link Dead was in the chat pretty often. Uh, giving me so. pointers and stuff on how to do things in Lunar Magic, because I was kind of learning Lunar Magic live on stream when I made Grand Pool World. And uh, what's kind of funny about this level is I feel like this is what started... After this, we got a million Ghost Forest levels in, in Super Mario World. <laughs> I always uh, was a bit of a trendsetter at the time. Non-stop ghost forest.
obviously this is very uh this is very dram world kaizo mario world fishing boo section Oi! Oh no! I feel like it's true of it's it's true of ROM hacks. I I don't know to what extent it's true of other creative disciplines, but I kind of feel like for me, I started by at least for ROM hacks. I, I kind of feel like you start by emulating what other people do and their successes and like the things you like that other creators did. And then from there, you kind of find... That's how like you find your voice, so to speak. And I kind of feel like Grand Pool World 1, I was still... I was definitely still... Like, I'm inspired by Kaizo Mario World and Panga and G-Breeze. And I was kind of still finding my voice in there, you know? And I think with Grand Pool 2, I definitely, like, found my voice at that point, so... Like, I feel like it has more to do with... Combining things in a way you've never seen before rather than like behold what I have created from nothing You, you know, so if you're still combining and experimenting things and then You're making the right area, you know, you're in the right area playing with Legos Uh, Dasukin, thank you for the 13 months You learned so much making your first hack this year Oh, that like this N Koopa is like mega spawn dependent. Something something didn't spawn just right. Ah. Is this the <laughs> Even if I die, that's okay. <laughs> is this the the super long hallway? I love how there was like no explanation. Just not. I, I remember it's <laughs> like no, just a really long hallway. And uh, by the way, this is nothing. This doesn't even exist. There's nothing there. <laughs> Wait, where is it? Oh, <laughs> what a shitty troll! What a shitty fucking troll! So stupid. <laughs> ah. I think, uh, the shittier, more awful the troll. That's a pretty shitty, awful troll. But it's made funny because the level itself is not hard. It's like a really short, one-off little section here. You know? So... There's some kind of, like, ratio. There's some kind of, like, ratio there, you know? Like, really fucking awful troll, really terrible troll, a light, easier, like, light hand of a level. Y you know? There's some kind of ratio there that works. Uh, the inverse of that would be the Dram 2 Dolphin level. Uh, the Dram 2 Dolphin level, man. All right, here we go. Yump. The troll ratio. There we go. The yump slump is over. The yump. Uh, Ethereal Prophet. Thank you for the 25 months. Make it so getting off to somebody's suffering. <laughs> How are you any different, Twitch chatter? How many times have you watched me get annihilated by a ROM hack and laugh at my ass?
So at the time when uh, when this was made, this was this was like really mind blowing for a number of people because um, they had never seen uh, layer two moving like this. So this was very very bizarre with it. Unfortunately. This would be a level that I kind of feel like it was cool at the time, but I feel like this section is really dated and really old. Um, really dated, really old. Um, not the best section in the game. Makes your brain hurt. It's definitely uh, unusual to get used to, for sure. <laughs> up pipe, yeah. There's a number of up pipes, both in Grand Pool One and Two, that did not need to be in the games at all. Those fish do nothing; they just distract you, so that you die to the uh, falling platform there. This is where the magic happens. That troll at the end is great. The fish. Yeah, the fish are just there to make you hesitate. Yeah, that's right. the fuzzy there. Okay. Ah! I think there's a rock about to fall on my head here, if I remember right. <laughs> oh! Fish was coming. Fuck! <laughs> the fish was coming. No! God. Give me a break, this fish! I believe when Kaizo 1 was made, there wasn't even map 16 in Lunar Magic. Which is crazy to think. I can't even imagine using Lunar Magic without map 16, honestly. <laughs> hey! Fish is sentient. Is scrolling enabled? This is no, it is disabled. Do you draw inspiration from your old hacks? I would say I draw inspiration from every ROM hack I play. And sometimes inspiration can be a negative or a positive force, I think. Like, you can also be inspired on what not to do, <laughs> you know? Bam! No, I should've just went for it. I should've just went for it. Me still on Marathon, what's Danger Zone like? <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, is that Smoke's the worst, worst midway attempt ever right there? <laughs> Shout out to these, oh, what amazing overworld events we have here. <laughs> All right, do those fire? No, those bullets do not fire. Wasn't this level in Dram World? Uh, no. No, it was not. 
Yeah, this uh, this song is really good. It's a really, really good song. G-Breeze is amazing. The song is better than the level, honestly. <laughs> Okay. Make it so. Uh, I think you might be able to get that there. Uh, Crusher Odinson, thank you very much. teacher is a more correct type you're welcome or you're welcome it's you are welcome not your welcome you are welcome sir so you you apostrophe re my welcome uh thank you crusher odinson is that a serious question i don't think you need to be a teacher to know that <laughs> Our welcome, comrade. Use welcome. Ah, oh, fuck off. <laughs> I think there were some Kaizos in 1.0 that I removed in later versions. Uh, I think there was one here and it's not anymore. Grand Pool World 1 uh, changed a decent amount between uh, between versions. Changed a good little bit. This is a level that I would consider nowadays, like, just, like, not good. <laughs> it works, it functions, but uh, would not call this level good by any stretch of the imagination. <laughs> ah. That's too bad, I like this level. Uh, I kind of think of this level as kind of a mess, and, uh, yeah, not a great level. Why? I mean, it's slow, you know, it's mostly holding down and swimming through a tunnel, like, the timing is just whatever, like, I don't know, not a great level, probably one of the least successful levels in the game, but, uh, hey, I did better in Grand Pool 2 with the water level, and I love the water level in Grand Pool 2. Here's my top five worst Grand Pool World levels. <laughs> yeah, SMB3 is a real fucking pain in the ass to use. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. What a terrible dive. Ah, that's tough. Right. 
<laughs> that was such a piece of shit. Now this section, this section might be one of the best parts of Grand World of uh, Grand World One. Very fun section. Maybe it could have been re maybe some of the obstacles could have been redone. Like I maybe wasn't the best, but this section is really fun. The music is great. Um, it's unique. I can't think of many. I, at this point, I uh, I can't think of many like Kaizo Mario World levels that were using layer two scrolling like that. Um, yeah, really cool. Maker of Grand Portal 2 copied that level in 1,000 halls. So true. Didn't Pooh die there? Yeah, a lot of people died there. <laughs> Cretation Cavern. Life finds a way. How's the plonk? Ah, uh, we're plonking, man. Ah! God. Queasy, I would say that in 99 hacks out of 100, nobody gives a flying fuck about the overworld. About 99 and 100, nobody gives a fucking shit about anything that happens on the overworld. No! Yoshi. Oh man, that section. Oh. Yeah, there's Kaiser there. <laughs> you love Bubble Bobble, does Barb not? Bubble Bobble is really cute for like three or four levels and then it becomes torture. Fucking fucking ninja shit. Fuck. Coolest puzzle you've had in Super Mario World? Uh, my favorite Mario World puzzles are all in, uh, they're all in Jump Half. jump is hard <laughs> that jump is really not easy all right item storage in yump 2 is so cool uh yeah dude uh, cabin fever in yump 2 is so, is like an incredible level i love that fucking level that level is so good 
Uh, Grand World 1 initially had a death counter, yes. Uh, I took it out because it was preventing people from playing the game on certain versions and emulators and stuff, so I took it out. Just removed it. Love you, Barb, no matter what. Well, thank you, Bonestorm. Uh, I think I should slide there or get P-Speed or something. I, I find the whole thing very strange and baffling. I find all of Rings of Power to be extremely strange. Fucking shit, man. Very weird to me. What a shitty troll. Oh, ah, we're dead. What a shitty troll. Very bright palette. Yes, this color palette is over the top. Yes. Have you ever teleported onto a Lania ship when attacking it? I have never done something so foolish. No way. I would never do that. I'm too smart to do that. It was everything everywhere all at once last night. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it, but by the end of it, I had kind of... By the end of everything everywhere all at once, I was like, oh, okay, you kind of spent the gimmick at this point and wrap it up. The end of it, I'd kind of lost patience with it, but I, I enjoyed the movie overall. Shit. I really appreciate that. Thanks so much. No. How did that happen? Let's bring back Wanch. Wanch. There we go. In other words, we're infallible. All right, let's do it. Ah! So. Bro, I'm gonna fucking hit every goddamn troll in this game. Ah, <laughs> oh, this jump off this falling spike is fucked, man. Jeez. Oh my god. I knew the pencil was there. All right. GG. Uh, young Gun, thank you for the nine months. Yump? The answer was Yumpent. <laughs> Wasn't around for past Barb, but he seems like a dick. You guys remember Push Pops? Were they like Flintstone Push Pops? You guys remember those? Man, 
Man, I haven't had one of those in so long. Hey! I haven't had a fucking push pop in a million goddamn years, man. The orange sherbet ones were fire. I haven't had one of those in a long fucking time. <laughs> They turn your smile into the Jokers. My God, I suck. <laughs> Oof. Remember when Lack played this level? Uh, I think I do. Did he play Grand? I don't know. Did he play Grand Portal One? This level is a perfect representation of my hairline. Yeah, this level is is what it's like on my hairline. <laughs> it's like they're constantly. Uh! Orb. Do you have the speed running record for this hack? Yeah, I have the world record in making this hack. That's my speed run record. He beat it in Grand World 2. What song was that? That was Dokati Mountain Rail. He spent like five hours, yeah. Red Keep. Oh, I didn't know that, well done. Oh, spin. Why do you end up on the beginning? So that actually, that ending is different from what was in the original 1.0 version. The original 1.0 version was much worse. Um, dude, I love this song. Ah. What a song. Uh-huh. <laughs> Something about the music starting when the RNG dolphin section part starts is so funny. <laughs> Such good timing. <laughs> People, I remember back in the day, people cried. Oh, this RNG dolphin section. It's so hard. They cried. Ah. They cried. <laughs> Fuck. Make it so. That, that dolphin section is so fucking short, man. Uh, Koryetsu, thank you for the 21 months. Kachi Mala, thank you for the 20 months. Appreciate that. Thank you very much. Oh, the crying. Uh, this boss fight is stupid. <laughs> this boss fight is stupid as fuck. Psychopaths, maybe. <laughs> 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 
All right. GG. Half Instagrammers. I mean, some people can be like that for sure. I'm, I can't say I would be one of them, but. Putting music out there can be really scary. Yeah, I, th I think, yeah, it's just kind of artwork. And I mean, putting your artwork out there and letting people like, you know, demolish it and talk about it and criticize it and love it and hate it. It's a scary experience. It's scary. Hmm. Who is me? Me is you. 